Today I want to talk about tracing as a part of the commission process. With my series of nine acrylic cats, those are paintings done for me for sale directly to the public, and it doesn't matter if they are exact likenesses. I drew those freehand directly onto the panels. But in the case of Chloe here, I really have to nail the likeness. So I printed out her photo at the size that I needed for this painting, and then I used carbon transfer paper to lightly get the outlines. And then you may have just noticed that I used a stencil to get the pattern in the background. Particularly with watercolor paper, I can't make a lot of mistakes and erase them, make mistakes and erase them, etc. like I might have to do if I freehanded her drawing. I have to be efficient with my time, and I don't want to rough up the paper. Tracing has a long history that goes back hundreds of years. Even the Renaissance painters invented new ways to transfer images onto their canvases. Chloe is still a work in progress.